Can I add my friend? Well, my parents are. Wait, dear, actually allow me. Bippity boppity boo, daughter of Rapunzel and Flynn. Um, actually, it's Eugene. Oh, I'm sorry, dear. You'll be needing this now. What is that? Dear, this is a high school for good and evil. This is how we track your behavior. Oh, you better get to class. Hi, I'm Ruby, daughter of Snow White. It's nice to meet you, Ruby. I'm Mizura, daughter of Rapunzel. Oh, I'm a big fan of your father. Could you help me hold my books? Of course. Thank you. Hey, so question. Who are all those guys over there? Mizura, those are the villain kids. Don't make eye contact. Would your hair happen to be magic love? Oh, feisty. I'm sorry love. I shouldn't have touched it. What's the matter? Did you figure out who my father is? Why did my scale move towards evil? Maybe because you have a crush on a villain's son. Why did my scale just move towards evil? Maybe you have a crush on a villain's son. Who are you the son of? Why don't you take a wild guess love? You're the son of Captain Hook? Indeed. I shouldn't be talking to you. This is Mizura. Oh hi, I'm Freya daughter of Kristoff and Anna. You have magic hair don't you? Don't tell anyone else. Sorry of course not I won't. Mizura your scale. Were you talking to the villain kids? Can you blame her? They are so fine. Freya this is serious. I heard someone wants to steal her hair. You can't trust the villain kids. Don't talk to them. Okay I won't. Well well. If it isn't Rapunzel's daughter. Stop it you stay away from me and my hair. Take it easy love. I was just going to ask you to come to the spring ball with me. I'm already going to the ball with someone else. And who might that be? It's um. It's me. I'm Thomas son of Sleeping Beauty. I'm the son of Sleeping Beauty and Prince Philip. Really I didn't think they had a son. Well obviously they do. So if you'll excuse us pirate we're going to the ball. I'm really glad we met. Me too. Your hair is beautiful. You look just like your mom. Thanks. Is something wrong Missouri? What's the matter? Well it's just. I thought my scale would move more towards good since I've been hanging out with you for so long. Come here let me tell you a secret. Come here let me tell you a secret. Ha ha ha. Let me go you jerk. Who are you the son of anyway? I'm the son of the villain Hans, and I need you to sing me the song that activates your powers. I should have known by the red hair, and I am not singing you that song. Okay, don't sing, and I cut off all your hair. No. Ha ha ha. Why do you need my healing powers? Because Elsa's daughter froze my heart, and only your powers can heal it. I don't have much time so start singing. Go on sing. You should know that my hair's magic isn't as strong as my mother's. It doesn't matter. Now say the words. I'm running out of time. She sings. Make the clock reverse. What the? Step away from the princess. Pirate. Jack. Hello, love. Hey, what do you think you're doing? It's called winning mate. Hey. Is that Snow White boxes you have on? Shut up. Ooh. Ooh. Just wait until my parents find out what you did. I owe you an apology. My scale was not moving towards evil because you were evil. It was moving towards evil because I was judging you based on who your parents were. I'm sorry. It's all right love my father Captain Hook does have quite the bad reputation. I'm just glad that you're safe. Hey you're bleeding. It's just a scrape. Must have happened on my climb over here. Well I do have magic hair that heals. So why don't I just sing the song? Well wait just a minute love. Because I reckon your lips are going to be a bit busy. How many did you get? Five thousand. Wow baby. This year I'll be able to talk to you a lot daddy. Actually honey I have to go on a business trip. But we can talk when I get back okay. Mommy it's been two weeks haven't you heard from daddy yet? No honey. I, I think something might have happened to your father. Mommy. Your mom needs surgery, but she doesn't have enough words to pay for it. I can pee with mine. Are you sure it's gonna cost a lot of words? So is my mommy, all better now. Sweetheart, we tried all we could, your mom didn't make it. We tracked down one of your relatives, this is your Aunt Hilda. Hello. She has a lot of words she can give to you. She'll need to earn them. Did you finish all of your chores today? Good, here you go. Only three. You're lucky I gave you that, take out the trash. It's not my fault you didn't get words this year. No. Sees a letter in trash. This looks like a letter from my dad. What was this doing in the trash? Mizura what is in your, give me that. Get back, how dare you look through my trash you nosy little child. Oh what you want me to give you more words now hmm? 
Well that won't be happening and this letter isn't from your father it's from someone pretending to be him. If you go through my trash one more time you'll never get another word from me again. You missed a spot Mizura. I'm going to take a nap you keep cleaning, see you later. Now's my chance to find the letter. This has to be real. Aunt Hilda tricked him into giving all of his words to her, and now he's stranded. This whole time I thought he was dead. I have to help him, but I need words. The next day. Where are you off to? What are you? Oh, today's the first day of school. Well, have fun making friends with no words. By Missouri. Sorry, I can't help you. I'm late for work, kid, excuse me. This isn't working. Hey, that old lady looks like she's about to. Oh. Oh, thank you, dear. I almost fell over. What's your name, dear? Oh, you don't have any words, do you? Well. I have plenty to spare. Here you go. Thank you. You have no idea how much this means to me. Of course, honey, use them wisely. What's that smirk on your face all about? Excuse me, I'm making dinner. Do you want some? No, thank you. How did you? Who gave you words? You know what? Let me see that notebook, you secretive little child. We'll work for words. You thought you could lie to me, think again. How could you not tell me my father was alive? He writes to you every year, you know, and I always throw his letters in the fire, but this year I got a little sloppy and put it in the trash. Why would you steal words from him? He's your own brother. He had millions of words and would never share with me and neither would your mother, which is why I had to get rid of her. What? Your mother's surgery didn't go well for a reason. Look, I needed you to become an orphan. Why? So legally I could control your words. You are sick, but I have a lot of words and I'm going to send them to my father. Go ahead, he needs at least 3,000 to come home. Well that's perfect, because I have just enough. What? Well then I can't have you doing that. Thanks to your big mouth you'll be staying in this attic, until further notice. Dad? It's me honey, I got your words. I missed you so much Mizura. Your Aunt Hilda has been arrested, but are you okay? I am now. Prince Daniel will you be my valentine? Sorry princess I can't. Why not? My mom says I haven't arranged marriage. To another princess. Prince William, are you ready for our valentine's day? Princess Mizura. Date. It's not what it looks like. Give me back my heart. I'm sorry. I didn't realize he was with you princess. I'm just gonna go. Mizura you only have one heart left. And if it breaks something horrible will happen to you. No more dating. What? I'm sorry but you don't have a good taste in men. I will be picking a husband for you. Mizura meets your husband to be Prince Darren. Hello she's beautiful. Give him your heart. I promise to take good care of it. Mother may I speak to you in private please? Of course. I'm not giving him my heart. Mizura why not? Because I was getting a really creepy vibe from him. Didn't you see the way that he was smirking at me? That's what men do when they like you. Mom no they don't. You need someone to protect your heart. And that's what he's going to do. This is my last heart. And I'm not trusting that prince with it. If she doesn't believe me, then I have no choice but to run away. Excuse me, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to frighten you. I'm just a commoner and you. You're the princess. I'm realizing now. I probably shouldn't have left the palace with my crown on. I see her she's down there. They found me. What's wrong? I need you to keep my heart safe. Princess I couldn't. Please. Get her. Please take it this is my last heart and if it breaks. Something bad will happen to you. Someone's trying to break it. I will do my best to protect your heart princess. Get her. Run. But what about? Run. Running away from the castle are we? Come here. I found her your majesty. Let go of me. Mizura. Where is your heart? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? I mean I don't know because I gave it to another man. What? What was his name? I'm not sure mother I didn't ask. Could I have a moment with my fiancé alone? Of course your highness. You can play all the games you want princess. I will marry you and I will find the man who took your heart. Look all you want you're not gonna find him. We shall see. Prince Darren we have found him. They were too fast princess I'm sorry. 
where's the princess's heart? Well that's the thing, Prince Darren you may have caught me, but she'll never find where I hid the princess's heart. How dare you hide my daughter's heart? My queen I say we send him to the torture chamber. No. It's the only way to get him to talk. Mother please. Missouri Prince Darren is right. He still won't talk. We only got his name William. Mother let me speak to him please. He will tell me where my heart is. Oh my goodness. What have they done to you? I promise to keep your heart safe. And I don't break my promises. I can't let you suffer for me. But the prince that you're supposed to marry. I can tell he is evil. I know William. But that's my problem not yours. Where's my heart? Finally her heart is where it belongs. All right mother. Prince Darren has my heart. Now let William go. No dear I'm afraid I can't do that. William is going to be killed. For stealing your heart and hiding it. It must be done. I told him to do it. Oh Missouri. You're just trying to protect him. I know. It was such a tough decision princess. May I speak to her alone? Of course Darren. Don't be so sad. Get away from me. We shall be married tomorrow. I will never marry you. Oh, but you will. That is if you want William to live. Marry me tomorrow, and I'll convince your mother to let him live. And if you try anything I will break your last heart. Do you understand? Do you accept Prince Darren as your husband? I do. Excellent now may I kiss the bride. Stop, that prince is evil. William, he escaped. And he's lying. It's true mother he's been threatening me. What? I warned you not to speak against me. No. Her heart. Why is nothing happening? Because it was my lost heart not yours. William. His last heart. It's broken. What happens when your last heart breaks? I'm pretty sure you. You die. Ha ha ha. How could you? Mom there has to be something that we can do for him. Missouri I'm so sorry. This is all my fault. Just be happy that it wasn't your heart. Arrest him. Get off of me. You should be arresting him. He took her real heart. My heart I can give him my heart. William where did you put my real heart? I. William? Missouri. Don't speak to me. Darling they found it. The guards found your heart. My heart do you think it'll work if I give it to him? I'm not sure dear but it's worth a try. William the first want to give you my last heart. Please wake up. William's eyes open slightly. He gasps for air. William. Missouri. Ready for your curse, honey? I'm scared. Haha, ha, remember mine was just that I couldn't eat candy. And after you kiss your soul mate your curse goes away. So once you kissed mommy you could eat candy? Yeah, she would be so proud of you. I miss her. Me too. You can't tell anyone about your curse. Mizura meet your new stepmother. Shake my hand. Don't just stand there. She needs to learn manners. This is my daughter Gretel. Ooh, I love your necklace. You should just give it to me. Ha ha. Oh. I didn't mean to do that. Ha ha well that sucks for you. It's mine now. You're going on a business trip for five months. You'll be fine. No you cannot leave me alone with these two bit. Stop hold your tongue. You were not about to call the net. Oh. Okay let it go. Look by the time I come back, you'll probably have met your soulmate, and your curse will be broken. I highly doubt that. So have you kissed your soulmate? No I, I haven't. I think my soul meets the prince. I'll be kissing him soon. Good for you. So what's your curse? I'm actually not really allowed to say. Literally just say it. My gosh. I have to do everything that I'm told. Mother did you hear that? You're joking. Hmm, Patcher's shoulder. Huh, mother she wasn't kidding. Pull your hair. Oh. Ha ha. ha. Listen you guys this curse is not a joke. You can't just. Stop talking. From now on you're going to do exactly as we say. Pour me some more tea. Give me a back massage. Buy us some milk. And hurry. I'm back the milk is in the fridge. What's up with you? Nothing. Missouri tell us why you're happy. Go on speak. When I was at the market I saw the prince. And I'm pretty sure he's my soulmate. And he can break my curse. What? How do you know the prince is your soulmate? Tell us. We know you can't resist. Someone told me to go find my soulmate. And after they said that, I went straight to the prince and held his hand. And what exactly did he say to you? He told me he wanted to see me again. But then his guards came. And they didn't let me talk to him anymore. 
Of course they wouldn't let you talk to him. You're a peasant and he's a prince. Mother you told me the prince was my soulmate. He's supposed to kiss me and break my curse not hers. Remember she has to do everything she's told. So we'll just tell her. You are forbidden to ever kiss the prince. No. Mizura get the door. Mizura. Your Highness. I just had to see you again. I had my guards find out where you live. Listen I need your help with my curse. My stepmother she's controlling. Your Highness. Hi ignore her she's our maid. You're not their maid right? Of course she is. Tell him you're our maid. I'm their maid. Listen I need to speak to Mizura alone. But your highness. You heard the prince's stepmother. He wants to speak to me alone. Of course just don't listen to a word he tells you. So you need help breaking your curse. What? Mizura listen to me. You need me to break your curse. Right, yes my curse. You still haven't told me what it is. But it doesn't matter because I'm almost positive I'm your soul mate. So I should just. Oh okay well that. That hurt. I'm so sorry. You don't want me to kiss you. No I didn't mean to do that. I forgot that I wasn't allowed to. Look it's alright. Maybe we just aren't soul mates after all. Maybe we're not soul mates. No your highness. Wait my curse it's. It's what? I can't tell you unless you tell me to say it. I'm such an idiot you're cursed. It's to do everything you're told isn't it? Yes. Wait but then why did you slap me? You have to tell me to kiss you. Oh okay well then um. Oh. Mother you just knocked out the prince. It's what my dad would- And with any luck, he'll wake up with amnesia and forget all about you. You can't do that. Yes I can and you both are getting locked down here. Go to sleep. No. Ha ha ha. Goodbye. Later. Mizura, Mizura wake up. Hey. Mizura kiss me. Tell me to do something. Uh, jump up and down. Hey. It worked. I'm free. Yes, we're soulmates. Your Highness, we received your distress signal. Let go of us, you fools. Mizura attacked the guards. Yeah, that's not gonna work anymore. No, you kiss the prince. Yeah, I did, and it was really nice. Also, I'll be taking this back. You know I loved you, right, Mizura? Goodbye, stepmother. Wait, no. Sorry ladies, Mizura is making her own choices now. Share the same hair, or share the same clothes, as my soulmate? I didn't spend two years growing this hair out, for it to get ruined. Wash your clothes. Let's hope this prince soulmate of mine has some style. A prince would never wear this. Is my soulmate. Some sort of a lumberjack, or worse. What if he's a peasant? What are you wearing? I hate to inform you of this mother, but these are my soulmate's clothes. Is your soulmate a peasant? Possibly. Absolutely not. You are forbidden to meet this boy. Yes, mother. I need to go out. I can't be seen in this. Why isn't it coming off? Great. Mother said never to go anywhere without my crown. But today I can't let anyone know I'm a princess. I really hope I don't get recognized. Ooh. Oh I'm so sorry. I swear I didn't mean to. You have the same outfit as me. You're wearing my same clothes so we must be soulmate. Shoo, someone could hear you. I can't have people knowing my soulmate is a peasant. Who do you think you are? Look at me. Yeah, I'm looking at you. Really look at me. Uh, okay. Ow. I am the princess you idiot. Wait you are? Yes and I have a ball to go to tonight. And I am stuck in your dumb clothes. I need you to do me a favor. Okay, I'm back and I need you to wear this. You want me to wear a dress. That's not happening. But you have to I can only wear what you wear please. It's not my fault you picked. Hey, come on don't cry. Alright fine princess I'll do it. Okay thank you. Peasant it worked. My name is Nick and I can't zip this up. Has anyone seen my daughter? My mom's coming. Go hide in that alleyway. Oh. Hello mother. I've been looking for you. How are you wearing that dress? What are you talking about? You can only wear what your soulmate wears. Did you disobey me and speak to him? Mother, I would never directly disobey you, 
the system just had a glitch. And now it looks like I don't have to wear my soulmate's clothes anymore. Okay, then you better be at the ball tonight and stand up straight. Of course, mother. She seems nice. Yeah, she's a, uh, she's something. Listen, princess, I can barely breathe in this dress. I just need 30 minutes to make an appearance then I'll tell my mom that I feel sick and I'll be out of there. There's a lot of princes at the ball. I can see that. Since you're forbidden to talk to your soul mate, why don't you talk to one of them honey? Just because you and dad didn't work out doesn't mean that me and my soulmate won't. Excuse me, go to your room. Fine, perfect timing actually. What was that? Nothing. I have to get back to him before he starts ripping this. Soulmate's clothes coming off. Dress. Nick you can take this off now and quickly because there is a giant hole in the back. Okay, but you realize it's night now. Yeah and? And I like to sleep shirtless. Okay well you can't do that because that means I would have to sleep without a shirt. Well I made a sacrifice for you today so maybe. Ah. Uh. You know what, just for that comment, you are going to be wearing this robe tonight. Are you serious? Yeah go change. Hey. The things I do for you. Soulmate changing clothes. Much better. How long am I gonna have to keep wearing your clothes? I don't know as soon as this soulmate thing wears off I guess. Well, then there's something about me you need to know princess. There's something about me you need to know. Wait before you tell me, I just wanna say. I really appreciate you wearing my clothes for me and I don't care if you're a commoner. I, I want to be with you. Princess the queen has been looking for you. I was just. Enough you're coming with us. Good morning. Mother, about last night. Don't worry about it, honey, I've taken care of everything. You no longer need to wear your soulmate's clothes. Look. What did you do? Well since the king is in charge of the system I made a deal with him for you to marry his son. Well that's ridiculous and I'm not agreeing to that. Honey, the deal has already been made, the prince is on his way. What? It had to be done. No. Yes, you certainly won't be marrying your peasant soulmate. I present to you your fiancé. Hello, princess. But I... Thought that I was a peasant. I only dress like that because I don't like to get recognized. I'm sorry. It's all right I wanted to tell you, but I'm glad to see that you love me for me. And I love you.